And now, CBS 4 Sports with Clay Williams. Hello, Rio Grande Valley High School football fans. CBS 4 Sports Director Clay Williams here with my picks for week nine of the Valley High School football season. Before we let you know what our picks are for this week, let's let you know how we did last week. And the answer is, eh, not so good. Two weeks ago, our best week ever, 23, 24 and 3. Last week, just 18 and 8. That drops us from 77% for the season down to 76%, 153 and 48 overall. Let's see if we can bump that up with our picks for week nine this week. And let's start with Thursday's games and start with McCallum. McAllen Rowe at Mission, a huge game, and I believe that McAllen Rowe, now that they know that their coach will be gone once the season is done, now that uh, Paul Reyes has given his resignation, I believe that Rowe will be uh, motivated to get a big win on the road there. Rio Grande City is at Edinburgh Vela. I believe the Sabercats keep that unbeaten streak going through Week 9. Wessico East at PSJA North, a big game in District 31-6A. I've got the Wildcats winning on the road at Fars PSJA Stadium. Harlingen travels to Brownsville Veterans for that incredible 32-6A gauntlet. I've got Harlingen and the Cardinals defense coming away with the win at Sam Stadium. Those are your games for Thursday. Let's start with Friday. Let's start going west to east in the Valley. We'll start with Juarez Lincoln and Palmview playing at La Jolla ISD Stadium. I've got the Palmview Lobos coming up with a win there. Far Valley View takes on Mission Veterans at Tom Landry Stadium. I believe the Patriots get the win in that one. The Snakeskin Classic is what they call it at Missions Thompson Stadium as Pioneer and Sheriff Sherryland, two from the Sherryland School District will get after it, and I've got Sherryland winning that game as well for the second straight year. McAllen Memorial at McAllen, what they're calling the Mac Bowl, and I've got the Mustangs staying undefeated on the year with a win over the Bulldogs there. Economides takes on Edinburgh at Edinburgh's Cat Stadium. I've got the Jaguars winning that particular cat fight. Let's go down to Hidalgo, where LaGruya and Hidalgo fight for what could be the final playoff spot in District 16 4A Division 1. I've got the Gators coming away with a win over the Pirates. Ed Couch Elsa travels to far to take on PSJ Southwest and the Javelinas. I've got the Yellow Jackets coming up with a win there. Brownsville Porter at Donna. What a great ground game this will be for both teams. The game will probably only last about an hour and a half. I've got the Donna Redskins staying on top of that district. PSJ Memorial travels to Wessico and Bobby Lackey Stadium. The Panthers are just too tough, defense too strong, running game too powerful. PSJA takes on Mercedes at the new Tigers Stadium. Expect the Tigers to win that one over the Bears. In Harlingen, it will be Brownsville Hannah taking on the South Hawks. And I've got Brownsville Hannah with a bit of an upset on the road there as the Golden Eagles should get the win at Bogus Stadium. Progresso goes up to Willisie County to take on the Raymondville Bearcats. The Bearcats coming off that big win over West Oso last week says here they will win two in a row. Bearcats should get the win over the Red Ants. Brownsville Rivera goes up to Los Fresnos to take on the Falcons, and I've got the Falcons winning at home, whereas Corpus Christi West Oso will travel to the Bay to take on the Port Isabel Tarpons. Big Blue will get a win rebounding from their loss last week to Rio Hondo. San Benito travels to Brownsville to take on the Lopez Lobos. Expect the Greyhounds to keep their winning ways going, and a huge game in the private school ranks is Austin St. Michael's will be playing at Brownsville St. Joseph. A big win for the Bloodhounds is what's expected here at Canales Field on Friday night. We have lots of big games that will be out of the Valley on Friday night. Many of our local, the smaller teams will have some big games. Santa Rosa travels to Bishop to take on the Badgers. I've got the Warriors getting their first win of the season. Laferia travels to Kingsville to take on the King Bramas. The Lions should get the win on the road. Santa Maria traveling to Ben Bolt. I'm afraid Ben Bolt might be, just be a little too much for Santa Maria's Cougars there. Lavia travels to Riviera to take on the Calfer Seahawks, and I've got Lavia with a huge win there in what will probably be a game for the district title. Lyford travels to Falfurias to take on the Jersey Bulls. I've got Lyford and the Bulldogs continuing their winning ways on the road. Rio Hondo at Orange Grove. Man, what a big game this is. It was so close last year. I expect it would, will be a close one again, but I've got Orange Grove's Bulldogs coming away with a win over Rio Hondo's Bobcats. And Monte Alto will travel to, Fe to Freer, and I've got Monte Alto winning that one on the road. Only one game to tell you about on Saturday. That will be Donna North and the Chiefs traveling to Brownsville to take on the Pace Vikings. And I've got the Vikings winning that one as well. Those are your picks for week nine of the Valley High School football season. We'll see you right back here next week.